Welcome to Preform Line Products. The following presentation illustrates the recommended hot stick application of PLP's Swan Flight Diverter. Each Swan Flight Diverter is composed of a large center coil for visibility and two helical gripping sections. For installation, the Swan Flight Diverter should be gripped in the middle of either the second or the third coil of the large center coil. The tools to be utilized in this installation are a hold stick or a shotgun stick and PLP's applicator ring tool. Position the hold stick perpendicular to the coil. Making sure to be centered, tighten the hold stick onto the Swan Flight Diverter until it is held firmly. Turn the Swan Flight Diverter to a vertical position and place it onto the conductor or strand directly above the hold stick. Return the Swan Flight Diverter to a horizontal position and rotate the left end of the large coil section up and over the conductor. Repeat for the right side, making sure this time that the large coil section goes under and around. Once the large center section has been wrapped, use PLP's applicator ring tool to wrap the helical gripping sections onto the conductor or strand. Utilizing the same process as the hold stick, use the shotgun stick to firmly hold one of the middle two coils. Place the Swan Flight Diverter onto the conductor or strand just above the hold location and wrap the middle section. Complete the installation by wrapping the helical gripping legs onto the conductor or strand. This completes the hot stick application of the Swan Flight Diverter. This featured preform product is manufactured in the United States and is backed by the experience and field support that PLP has been noted for since 1947. All safety guidelines set forth in the appropriate application procedure for this product must be reviewed and followed prior to installing this product. The installation shown is intended to illustrate the application method of the product only. It is not intended to supersede any standard utility safety guideline and practices or use of required protective equipment.